we're doing an amazing digital circus build challenge. But by using the command slash slash mix, I can instantly combine my Pomni and Jack's build. And little does my friend know, I'm gonna be filling up the whole entire build with a whole bunch of traps to prank him. But now let's go check out my friend GE. And GE, wait. Uh, what in the world is going on? Bubbles, you gotta help me cane trap me inside of his prison. You'll never escape from my all-seeing eyes. Oh no, G, don't worry, I'll get you out. Ah! Ah! But Bubbles, what in the world are we doing today? We're gonna be doing a build challenge with a twist. Wait, what the what? A twist? We're gonna be randomly picking one character from each one of these dispensers and then combining both of them into one single build. Whoa, that sounds super cool. So I'm gonna flick the first lever and see what character we get. Come on, come on. And it looks like we got... That's Jax from Digital Circus. I love Jax. He's super cool. But wait a second. What character are we going to get next? Well, let's just see. We're going to be mixing Jax with... Please be Jumbo Josh. It's Pomni. Are you serious right now? I mean, I guess that is still pretty cool. Yep, it is. But GE, we only have 10 minutes to make this build. So you better get started. Let's go. Now that GE can't hear me anymore, I can type in slash slash paste. And nice. Our Pomni and Jax builds just spawned in. Now to combine them into one character, all we have to do is type in slash slash mix. And oh my god, it works. It looks like Jax just put on Pomni's little jester outfit. We are so ahead of G right now, but I think it's time to put in some traps. And for my first trap, I'm going to be making a fake entrance. Where should I put it? Hmm. I know. Let's put it right inside of Pomni's little jester shirt. We'll go ahead and make the entrance out of some secret doors disguised as emerald blocks. Emeralds are GE's favorite, so this is definitely going to lure him into our trap. For this trap, GE's going to have to complete a super difficult moving parkour jump. And if he falls, he's going to get destroyed by a bunch of these deadly crabs. Holy moly, look how big those pincers are. I definitely would not want to fall down here. But now that the crabs are spawned in, we can start building our parkour jump. Let's start by putting a motor down just like this, and then attach some blocks using the super glue. And last but not least, with a single click of a button, we can start rotating the entire thing. And wow, it's gonna be super difficult for G to make it across. But if he somehow figures it out, then he can collect his prize at the end of the room. And don't worry guys, I haven't forgotten that this is the fake entrance, so we're gonna make this prize completely fake. With this little command block over here, when he opens up the chest, it's just gonna spawn in this super big hydra. Ah, uh, what the heck is doing so much damage? <laughs> Make sure you guys are sticking around to see GE get completely destroyed by this Hydra. But just like that, and our fake entrance is completed. And before moving on to building the real one, I want to go check on GE to see how he's doing. Before the competition, I secretly put a little spear hook launcher in this chest. So let me just grab it real quick. And if I shoot it up here just like this, I can swing all the way to this platform like Spider-Man. Now we can finally break out a few blocks into the wall. And look at that, we can see GE building. All right, just a few more blocks. And there we go. My Pomni and Jack's mix build looks so good. What do you think of it, Mr. Pumpkin? What the? Why is GE talking to a pumpkin? Has he got insane? You like it? Me too. But little does Bubbles know, I'm gonna place a ton of traps around my entire build with this super secret treasure at the end. And we only have eight minutes left, so this is gonna be perfect. Wait, we only have eight minutes left? I gotta get back to my build. Go, go, go. All right, now that the fake entrance is completed, it's time to put in the real one. And I think the perfect spot for it would be right inside of Pomni Jax's face right over here. Let's replace these blocks with a whole bunch of ghost blocks. And look at that. Now it's super duper hidden and you can't even tell anything's there. Now it's time to go inside and start cooking up our first official trap. For the first trap in my build, GE is going to be given a bow and a whole bunch of arrows. With this, he's going to have to fight and defeat Zubo from Digital Circus. Let's go ahead and place down a command block underneath this chest. Now when GE opens up this chest, two Zubos are just going to spawn in. And they're going to be equipped with some bow and arrows as well. Hopefully GE is going to be able to defeat them before they get him. But just like that, and our Zubo bow battle room is completed. I can't wait to see GE fight Zubo, but for now we can open up this door and move on to building our next trap. For the next obstacle in my build, GE is going to have to find a way to escape the digital circus tent. Let's make it look as accurate as possible. There we go. And now with the tent completed, we can give GE three different doorways that he can choose in between. For the first door on the left, it's going to be a door leading straight to Kofmo's room. Let's put a sign above the door that says Kofmo's room. There we go. And inside of his spooky little room, we're just going to spawn in an abstracted Kofmo. All right, hurry, let's close this door and leave it as a surprise for GE. The second door that GE can choose to open is this red exit door right over here. Let's write down exit door. And we got to be super careful with this one because right when we go through this exit door it's going to teleport us to the void <laughs> that was super duper scary I can't wait to see GE fall for it okay now that our two trap doors are set up we're going to have to put down the correct one and for the correct one we're going to be putting down a blue door because it's the best color in the world if GE chooses to open up this blue door it's just going to safely lead him to the next room oh yeah our digital circus tent room is completed and now we can move on to building our boss fight room for the boss fight GE is going to have to fight a huge wave of pomnies so let's build out a room big enough to hold all of them and then let's go ahead and put down some super secure iron bars to make sure that they don't escape and now to help me spawn in the pomnies you have to hit that like and subscribe button in three 
two, one. Thank you for subscribing and oh my god. Look at how many Pomnies just spawned in. And they're all looking at me super creepily. So I'm just gonna get out of here. Go, go, go. Whew. These Pomnies are super powerful. So we're gonna have to give GE some gear to fight with. But the twist is it's all gonna be inside this password protected chest. Let's go ahead and make the password 3456. And let's go ahead and fill it up with a full set of copper armor, a minigun, and some bullets. This should definitely be enough for him to defeat these Pomnies. But now that we got everything in the chest, we gotta give GE a way to figure out the password. And I have just the perfect idea. There's gonna be two buttons on the wall just like this and only one of them is gonna be right and come on guys blue is literally the best color in the world so obviously green is gonna be the wrong one and blue is gonna be the right one let's go ahead and put a trap behind the green button just like this and now when ge goes to press the green button he's just gonna get teleported into the cage with pomnies ah uh, pomnies stop ah! that was terrifying but if ge presses this blue button it's actually gonna shoot out a piece of paper with the code right on top and yes sir our pomni boss fight room is completed i have a super cool idea for my next trap but before moving on to building it i want to go troll ge real quick i secretly hit some special tnt inside this chest so let me just grab it real quick and then we'll break out a few blocks into the wall just like this and oh my god i can see ge building my palm and jack's build looks so good i'm almost finished wait what he's almost finished i need to quickly grab this invisibility potion and then go completely invisible all right now we can fly up to ge and prank him this build is super cool i bet it's way better than bubbles what the just for that i'm gonna prank him even harder let me just place down four of this tnt just like this with a green pressure plate in the middle and in front of it we're just gonna write stand in the middle for free emeralds and now we can run away and wait for him to fall for it let's go i'm almost done with my build and wait a second what's that smell oh i think he noticed it oh my god stand in the middle for free emeralds okay say less let me just step on this beautiful green pressure plate wait he stepped on it he stepped on it and wait a second what's that noise and what the heck was that? That wasn't a bunch of emeralds. That was a bunch of arrows. Holy moly. That was actually insane. Who did this? I'm gonna find you. Okay, nice. While GE's gonna go and find no one, I'm gonna go in my inventory and grab this bazooka. And then we're just gonna blow up his build. Run away, run away. And wait a second. What the heck? What happened to my build? <laughs> he has no idea that it was me. Are you serious right now? I literally have to clean up this entire build. And we only have five minutes left to do this. This is super bad. Wait, what in the world? Did he say five? minutes i gotta hurry up and get back to my build we don't got much time left so we gotta build this fast for this obstacle ge is gonna have to get through a super dangerous parkour and i say that this parkour is dangerous for a good reason if ge falls off he's gonna get eaten by these giant anglerfish holy moly they look like they just came from ohio now that all the anglerfish are spawned in we can start building our parkour let's start off with a few easy jumps just like this and then we're gonna have some spring jumps all the way to the other side let's add some ladder parkour on the wall and we'll even add a little head hitter all the way up here then this is where things start to get a little bit crazy this next jump is going to require ge to do some regular ladder clutches all the way up here but this entire pillar is going to be spinning let's see how difficult this really is and wait wait what the heck i already fell off i have no idea how ge is going to get past this but if he somehow does then he can make it to the end safely on these easy fence jumps and voila our dangerous anglerfish parkour is completed i can't wait to see ge fail this over and over but for now we can move on to building our next trap and wait a second we only have two minutes left i gotta build this fast to get through this obstacle ge is gonna have to fight and defeat some silverfish and i know you might be thinking bubbles silverfish are super easy to defeat and i completely agree with that but it's not gonna be easy for ge when he's super duper tiny now at this size the silverfish look like some giant mobs let's build out a super tiny doorway to force him to shrink down and then we'll go ahead and put a shrinking device inside this item frame right over here now to spawn in the silverfish we're gonna put down a trip wire over here just like this so now when he hits the trip wire it's just gonna activate these two dispensers over here we'll set up some redstone just like this and look at that our silverfish just spawned in in the middle we're just gonna break out two blocks like this and fill the holes with some lava so now when ge is fighting the silverfish he can knock them into the pool of lava this should help him out a lot once the silverfish are defeated he can morph back into regular size and move on to the last and final obstacle and because this is the last and final obstacle ge is gonna have to pick if he wants the diamond treasure or the emerald treasure let's go ahead and put a chest at the end of each hallway and you guys already know diamonds are beautiful amazing and the best in the world which means that the stinky emerald side is gonna be the wrong answer to punish ge for picking the emerald side we're just gonna replace all of these blocks with some ghost blocks so now when ge goes to collect this emerald prize he's just gonna fall to his doom oh let's see if he falls for that or if he's smart enough to pick the diamond side the chest on the diamond side is gonna contain his real prize which is gonna consist of a whole bunch of emeralds green crystals and his favorite poisonous potatoes let's fill up the rest of the chest and just like that our pomni jacks mix build is completed in perfect timing the timer just went off as well now let's go meet up with ge and check out each other's builds hey ge hey bubbles now that we're done with both of our builds who's are we checking out first well since my builds 
obviously way better than yours. You should check out mine. Okay, buddy, that is definitely not true, but I guess we could check out yours first. I didn't know what you're talking about, Bubbles. Come over here and check my Pomnian Jax. Wait a second, what the heck? This is actually pretty good. But gee, are you serious right now? Where in the world are her legs? The legs? Uh, uh, I didn't know what you're talking about. Pomnian Jax doesn't have any legs, remember? That is definitely not true, GE, but how do I even get in your build? I'll give you a hint, Bubbles. It's your favorite color. My favorite color? But there's a whole bunch of blue around here already. But wait a second, I think I see some light blue right up here. So this has to be the entrance. Good job, Bubbles. You figured it out. So now let's open these up and you can get to your treasure. Wait, what? I get my treasure just like that? Yup, since it was pretty hard to find the entrance, I decided to make it really easy for you. Wait, G, that's actually so nice of you. And I'm sure you gave me some diamonds as well. And, uh, uh. Wait a second, what the heck is going on? What the heck? Haha! <laughs> Brother, are you serious right now? This is a whole bunch of lava. Yup, there's a bunch of lava because you fell for the fake entrance. Yeah, I realized that when there was absolutely nothing in the chest, GE. Haha! <laughs> I guess I have to go find the real one now. Is it inside of Pomni Jax's buttons over here? No. Nope. I mean, you did say blue, so is it inside of her blue hand? No. Uh oh. What the heck, G? I can't find this entrance anywhere. Can you please tell me where it is? Are you serious, Rainio? Fine. I guess I will give you a hint, but only under one condition. Wait, what? What condition is that? Everyone watching the video is to like and subscribe right now. Like and subscribe? Quick, guys, I really want to know where this entrance is, so hit that like and subscribe button in three. Two, one, thank you for subscribing. All right, G, now they all liked and subscribed. You have to tell me where the entrance is. Wait, what the? I didn't think they'd actually do it. Oh, gosh. But fine, Bubbles, I guess I'll show you where it is. Follow me. Oh, yeah. And I didn't know how you didn't find it, Bubbles, because it's literally right over here. What the? This is such a hidden spot. I would have never found it. But, uh, G, -E, what in the world is this? Welcome to my Emerald Dropper. You're gonna have to choose between the lava, the water, the blue blocks, and the green blocks. Wait a second, G, -E, isn't this the easiest thing ever? Wait, what? Bubbles? What are you talking about, easiest thing ever? Well, just hear me out, GE. If I land on the blocks, I'm gonna take fall damage. If I land in the lava, I'm gonna get burned. So it's gotta be the water. Are you serious, Rainio Bubbles? Why would you go in the cold, disgusting, stinky, sweaty water when you can go in the lot and luxurious lava? The lava is definitely not luxurious. I'm gonna get burned. So I'm just gonna jump in this safe water just like this. And, uh, GE, wait a second. Why am I taking damage? Ah! Ha <laughs> ha! What the heck was that? Was that fake water? Yep, I told you it was the wrong answer. Oh my god. Well, I guess if that's fake water, then this has to be fake lava. So let me just jump down real quick and I'm literally getting burned. Ha ah. <laughs> ha! What the heck, G? I can't believe I fell for that. Fell for what, Bubbles? I think you just have a low pain tolerance. That is definitely not true, GE. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm sure about that, Bubbles. So what if I just threw a bunch of spicy peppers on you? Ew. Whoa, what the heck? Ha, 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 ha. Get that away from me. Ew. These peppers are so delicious. Don't you want to eat some, Bubbles? No, you know what? I'm just going to jump down into the blue. <laughs> How did I just add to the blue blocks? And are you serious right now? Why are you still eating those, GE? Uh, eating what? I don't know what you're talking about, Bubbles. Ew, that is really nasty. I gotta get away from you. I'm gonna jump in the last option I have left. And wait a second. I just made it down safely. Good job, Bubbles. You figured it out. So now let's open up these doors and move on to the next section. Okay, and G, what is this? This is my ice boating race course. And if you want to make it to the end, you're gonna have to get past all these platforms. What the G? I literally hate ice boating. But I guess I have to do it to make it through. Let me just open up this chest real quick. And G, are you serious right now? Why is it all green boats? Well, because green is the best color in the entire world. Stop the cap, bro. Blue is way better. Give me a blue boat. A blue boat? Fine. Let me just go inside of my my inventory real quick and ooh, i have more peppers Ooh, this is yummy this is super delicious what the heck you stop it i love eating peppers all right you know what ooh, i'm I just gonna go on the course eating. to get away from you come on come on just gotta be slow and steady and oh no i just got bounced all the way up here what the heck ah <laughs> what the heck was that, G? You didn't tell me there was spikes up there? I guess I should have told you that, Bubbles, but come on. Are you serious right now? That was not 900 IQ. Oh my gosh. Let me just try this again. I gotta be even slower, I guess. You got this, Bubbles. Come on. And look at that, G. I made it through. And wait a second. You just landed on the spikes. That's cheating. Well, I survived, so I'm just gonna move on to the next room. Let's go. And, uh, wait a second, G. What is all that? I put a hundred bees inside of this cage, and you're gonna have to fight them. Uh-huh, G. I hope you're joking right now. Because how am I supposed to be a hundred bees? Ah, what are you talking about, Bubbles? That's literally light work, no reaction. And I put a chest over here with a bunch of items, so open it up. Ooh, maybe this will help me out. Let me just open it up real quick. And brother, it's password protected. Haha, <laughs> yeah, I know about that, brother. Which is why I put a 
bunch of buttons around this room and you're gonna have to find the right one to get the password oh yeah i did notice those buttons so let me just start pressing all of them come on come on and wait a second there's a super nice looking blue one over here wait a second Ew, that button stings. What are you talking about, GE? It definitely does not. And because it's the best color in the world, I'm just gonna press it. And uh-uh, why am I in the void? Haha, <laughs> there's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. I should have known you would have made my favorite color a trap. Yeah, but you didn't. And there's still a bunch of more buttons around this room. So are you gonna find it? Well, based off the fact that you made my favorite color a trap, your favorite color must be the correct one then. All right, so are you gonna press it? Let me just try this out. Please work. And look at that. I just got a code. Let me type in one, two, three, four. <laughs> And whoa, a whole bunch of enchanted armor and a minigun. Good job, Bubbles. You look super dripped out. But now that you have all your armor, I'm gonna drop the walls in three, two, one, fight. Here I go. And oh my god, there's so many bees. Ah, I can barely even see anything right now. Can you get them? I think I can, GE, because even though there's a whole bunch of them, I'm taking like no damage. Whoa, I guess I didn't think about that. And this looks pretty fun. So I'm gonna join in two. Let's go. Let's go, GE. They're dropping like flies. Come on, two more. And there we go. Oh, yeah, we just took out all the bees. We're literally the best team ever. But now that we got all the bees, we can open up this door and go to the next section. Wee! But wait a second, GE. Where in the world am I? Welcome to my quiz bubbles. And you're gonna have to use this portal gun to answer my question. To answer your questions, well, what is the first one? Who is smarter, you or me? Well, GE, let me ask you a question. What's one plus one? Two. See, I got it faster than you, so I'm smarter. Wait, what? That's totally unfair, Bubbles. What are you talking about? And the answer is obviously 11, remember? All right, G, just based off of that, I already know what I'm gonna do. And what's that? I'm gonna pick Bubbles. And, uh, uh wait a second, why am I dying? <laughs> Dude, are you serious, Rainio? How is that wrong? Because obviously I'm way smarter than you. Ah, that is definitely not true, GE. But I guess if I want my prize, I just gotta go through. And it looks like there's another question. Who is better at dancing, Bubbles or GE? I guess we'll put that to test right now. Look at my dance moves, GE. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Are you serious right now? Those dance moves were super lame. Yeah, like you could do any better. Alright, just watch me, Bubbles. You're not ready for this. I'll be flossing. I'll be flossing. What the? How in the world are you doing that? I'll be flossing. Okay, okay. Okay, I get it, GE. I get it. You're better at dancing. I'll be are you serious, Radio? Why did you punch me off? I don't know, GE. I'm sorry. I guess I was just jealous of your dance moves. But based off of that little competition, I guess you're the better dancer, GE. Let's go! And wait, now I can move on to the next room. Good job, Bubbles. And now that you made it inside, welcome to my luxury hallway. Whoa, uh, wait a second, GE. Did you just say luxury? This is literally all made out of dirt. Uh, yeah? And what's wrong with dirt? Well, I don't know about you, GE, but it is definitely not luxurious. That's so cat, Bubbles. This is literally a millionaire hallway, but I did did put a bunch of items inside this chest, so maybe it'll change your mind. Well, let's just see what's inside. And, um, GE, I think you messed up because this is literally just a wooden sword. Are you serious, Rainy on Bubbles? I did not mess up. This is literally the best sword ever. I could probably get this for one cent, GE. It is not luxurious. But what do I do now? Well, whatever, Bubbles. I didn't put any trap inside of this room, so you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. Okay, that is true. There was no trap. And, uh, wait, wait a second. Is that Kinger from Digital Circus? Get him, Kinger. Get him. Get out of here. And, uh, it just spawned in a whole bunch of wither skeletons. Ah. <laughs> and wait a second, Bubbles, the mobs are stepping on the ship wire. They're multiplying. What the heck? There's literally so many of them. I just gotta run through. Go, 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 go. Come on. Woo, I think I'm safe now. Uh, uh, wait a second. No, I'm not. There's literally a baby kinger here. Wait a second. How did that baby get an iron sword? Get him. Ah, get away from me. Get away from me. Come on, just one more hit, and I took him out. Let's go. And are you serious right now? I can still hear all of these mobs. Yeah, there was at least a hundred of them, GE. But now that I made it through, what in the world is this room? You're gonna have to choose between the blue treasure and the green treasure. The blue or the green? Well, the green reminds me of some vegetables, and that is definitely ew. Wait, what? Vegetables are amazing! Cap, brother, cap. I'm gonna choose the blue side because blue is way better. Are you sure you don't want some lettuce? Come on. Uh, uh, ew, what the heck? I wanna go collect my treasure! And, uh, what the heck? <laughs> oh my god, the blue one was the wrong one. Yup, because you just fell for the fake treasure. Does that mean I have to go on the green side, GE? Yup, because green is amazing. It definitely isn't, GE, but I guess it's my only option left. So let me just open up this chest to see what's inside. And oh my god. It's a whole bunch of diamonds. I'm feeling richer than ever. You are pretty rich, Bubbles, but now that you went through my build, can I please go through yours? Sounds like a plan, GE. Let's go. Whee! When can I turn around? You can turn around in three, two, one. 
One, turn around. And oh my god. This build is huge. How in the world did he build this in 10 minutes? Because I'm the best builder in the world, GE. Are you serious, Radio Bubbles? You see that every single time. Well, yeah, because it's true. Just look at my Pomni and Jax. Yada, yada, yap, yap, yap. This build is huge. So how in the world do I get inside this thing? I'll give you a little hint, GE. It's your favorite color. My favorite color? So green. Oh, wait a second. I don't see any green inside of this build. Uh, GE, it's literally right in front of you, brother. What the what? are you talking about and oh i guess there is some green over here there you go but now we can just go inside to your first obstacle ge and wait a second is that mr krabs yep and if you fail this jump he's gonna take all your money oh no i don't want him to take my money so i gotta time this jump perfectly come on three two one ah! and no way you just fell <laughs> get away mr krabs i'm broke i don't got motion get him get him i can't believe that you died already ge are you serious right neo bubbles that was not funny well can you make it across this time uh yeah yeah, I think I can. I just gotta time it perfectly and I made it. What the? Good job, GE. You did it. And now you can collect your prize. Let's go. So let me just open up this chest and wait a second. Ah, what the what is this? Get him, Hydra. Get him. Ah! What the heck was that, Bubbles? He's literally eating Mr. Krabs. Yeah, because you just fell for my fake entrance, GE. Are you serious, Radio Bubbles? Then where in the world is the real one? You're just gonna have to go find it. Oh my, yeah. Maybe it's inside of their ears and no. Nope. Or maybe it's inside of her hand and... Are you serious right now? Not even close. Bubbles, I can't find the sanctions anywhere. Can you please give me a hint? I guess you're just not that good at finding things. And nope, I'm not giving you a hint. Hmm, I guess that is pretty unfortunate. I guess I'm gonna have to blow up your build to figure it out. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop it. I'll tell you where it is. Let's go. And I have no idea how you could have found a GE. It's right inside of Pomni Jax's face over here. Wait a second. What the? I could have never found that out. Well, now that you're inside, you're gonna have to get through your first obstacle. Just open up the chest and you'll figure out what it is all right so let's see what's inside this chest and whoa there's a bow and a bunch of arrows and ow are these a bunch of zoobles yep and they're shooting at you you gotta get them before they get you well good thing i'm the best archer ever so let me just shoot these arrows come on come on come on and i got one of them and look at that you died are you serious right now okay zoobel i am not having this get over here what the g is going all in and even though you didn't use your bow i guess you can make it to the next level let's go that was easy peasy and wait a second what are all of these doors. Well, since you made it past the Zubo Bow Battle, you've made it into the Digital Circus Tent, and you're gonna have to pick one of these doors to make it through. Choose one of these doors? Well, let me see my options. We got Cough Mo's room, we got the Stinky Room, and wait a second, an exit door? I got to get out of here, so let me just go through and wait a second. What the heck? You just fell into the void! Are you serious, right, Neo Bubbles? That was not an exit door. That was more like an Ohio door. Well, it makes sense, GE. The exit door leads to the void. But now that you know that the exit door is not the answer, which one of these two are are you gonna pick? Well, hmm, I do wanna check on Kofmo, so let me just go inside to this room, and wait a second, what the? What is this? Kofmo must have gone insane, and how you doing, buddy? I mean, you do look kinda different, and wait a second, why are you going after me? Ah! GE, you're not supposed to talk to abstracted Kofmo! I didn't know he was that different. Ah! Get away from me! Get away! And holy moly, GE, that was super close. I have no idea how you survived. Yeah, and I can see his head poking out right there. Uh, I guess I have to go inside to this super stinky blue door. Hey, it's not stinky at all, and it's your only option left. Blah, blah, blah. I don't know what you're yapping about, Bubble. So let me just open up this door and wait a second. Are these a bunch of Pomnies? Yep, it's about a hundred of them, and you're gonna have to fight them. Oh no, that sounds super scary, but I guess there is a chest here, so let me just open it up and... Are you serious right now? Why is the password protected? Because I wouldn't make it that easy for you, GE. You're gonna have to figure out a way to figure out the password. Are you serious, Ernie? Well, there are two buttons over here. We got a stinky blue button and a beautiful green button. Well, are you gonna press the green one? Well, can birds fly bubbles? Obviously, I'm gonna press the green button. Let's go and wait a second. Oh, no. Oh, Pomni, get away from me. Ah! <laughs> what the what was that, Bubbles? That was super rigged. It's not rigged, GE. You just picked the wrong button. Whatever, Bubbles. I guess I'll press the blue button. So let me just press it real quick. And whoa, it dropped the password. Yep, and now you can actually open up the chest. And it says 3456. Are you serious, Rainy? I totally could have guessed that. But let me just type in 3456. And whoa, there's a bunch of copper armor and a minigun. It's all for you. Well, now I'm super ready to fight these Pomnies. Pomni, bring it on. Good luck, GE. The walls are dropping in three. Two, one, 
fight. Come on. And whoa, you're already taking a lot of them out. This fight is easy peasy. I'm even taking out the babies. What the, Pomni? You gotta be stronger than that. Come on, just one more. Can you get her? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna start knocking her with these peppers. What the heck, GE? What is going on? Haha, <laughs> and I got her. I guess I made that a little bit too easy for you, but now that you defeated the Pomni's, we can move on to the next obstacle. Let's go. Wait a second, Bubbles. What the what are these things? They're a whole bunch of super hungry anglerfish. Hungry anglerfish? Oh no, I don't want to get eaten alive, so let me just do this parkour. And wait a second. Oh no, I already fell. What the heck? Gee, how did you feel the easiest jumps in the parkour? Come on, Bubbles. You didn't see that. That was just a practice round because you know me. I'm a parkour pro, baby. All right, well, let's see if you fall or if you make it through. Come on. I just got to make this head hit real quick. And whoa, that was super close. But can you do these ladder clutches? And wait a second. What the what? That jump was super scuffed. Ah! <laughs> okay, you know what they say, Bubbles. Third time's the charm. I'm just gonna make this jump over here and then over here. Come on, come on, come on. You got this, GE. And now I gotta be super careful. Let me just jump on this ladder real quick and then jump over here. Wow, this parkour is easy peasy. You're almost to the end, GE. Let me just make this jump and then make this jump and then one more jump come on and i did it no way i can't believe you actually made it through but now you can open up those doors and move on to the next obstacle and wait a second what the what is this bubbles is this supposed to be a door yeah ge just walk right through uh bubbles i am not as short as you i literally can't fit what the i'm not short at all but i guess you'll have to find another way to get through then hmm, well there is this weird looking device up here so let me grab it real quick and whoa it's a personal shrinking device yep and you can use it to turn super duper small and whoa, you're really tiny, Bubbles. I'm gonna step on you. Get over here. Ah, what the heck? What the heck? Just hurry up and turn small so we can make it through. All right, let me just turn on the machine real quick. And whoa, I'm just as small as you. Yep, and now you can fit right through. And whoa, this is super cool. So let me just walk through real quick and... Ah! What the heck? Why are there a bunch of silverfish? Get him, silverfish, get him! And what the? What just fell into the lava? Yeah, I guess that was pretty easy. Come on, let me just keep punching him, and I did it. What the heck? It was not supposed to be that easy. I think you messed up your trap bubbles. It must be because I'm super tall. Well, let's just turn back to regular size and move on to the next trap then. And whoa, is this my treasure? Yep, are you gonna pick the diamond treasure or the emerald treasure? The diamond treasure or the emerald treasure? Well, obviously, I'm gonna choose the emerald one. Let's go! Ha ha! What the what was that, Bubbles? I just fell from the sky. Yeah, I put a whole bunch of ghost blocks there because emeralds are not the right answer. Are you serious, Danielle? Well, I still want that emerald, so let me just jump on this chest right here and then take the emerald. Let's go. Oh my gosh, you weren't supposed to do that, but I guess you can have that one emerald. And fine, I guess I'll go down the diamond treasure. Let me just open it up real quick. And whoa, there's a bunch of emeralds, poisonous potatoes, and green crystals. It's all for you. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Ew, why are you actually eating those? Ah! But now that we checked out each other's builds, whose do you think is better? Well, looking carefully at both of her builds, I think that mine was way better. You can't be serious. Mine is way better. Wait, what the? The new wins. Uh, I guess we'll have to let the comments decide. Everyone comment GE. No, everyone comment Bubbles. Ah! But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you want to see another one of our adventures, then click the video on screen. Go click it, click it, click it. Bye. 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 Bye.